Hi YouTube, it's Lena, and I'm here today with the lipstick tag, which I was tagged by the blush beauty. Hi! And now I'm going to go through my massive amount of lipsticks and stuff because I have them all on the floor right now so I can actually count how many of everything I had. So my computer's over here, I'm going to be looking at questions, so if you see me looking off a lot, that's what it is. Okay, question number one. How many lipsticks do you own? Well, that's a complicated question because I don't just own straight lipsticks. For the uneducated, this is what I consider a lipstick. I don't like this lipstick, but it is a lipstick. So I actually went through and counted how much of everything that I had, and I'm going to read them off. Let's see. 14 lipsticks, like straight up lipsticks. I have two of these CoverGirl Outlast lip stains. I counted them on their own. You can't really see the colors, but their names are... I can't read this crap. Well then, maybe they're on here. No. No, never mind. Doesn't matter. One's red and one's like berry. Anyways, I don't want to get distracted. I have... Dropping crap everywhere. I have four of the Revlon Lip Butters. I have... Seven of what I counted as lip crayons. Most of them are from Revlon. There's a Jordana in there. There's a Tarte. And this Bite one that I got from the Sephora Give Me Some Lip thing. What's next? Okay, I have... 27 different types of lip gloss. I don't even like lip gloss. I don't know how I ended up with this much. I didn't even buy most of these recently, so I don't know. Like some of them that I really do like, either I bought recently or came with the lip thing from Sephora, which I do recommend, by the way. I love my lip, my stuff from that. I have four lip liners. I have 12 of what I called colored lip balms, or tinted lip balms, which is like this NYC Applelicious thing. It's the, th it's the lip balms that leave some tint. I did count my recent Ipsy Kalen lip balm as a lip balm, tinted lip balm, even though, honestly, I would call that sucker a lipstick. Anyways, and I have six of what I called chapsticks, although I don't actually own anything chapstick, but you know what I mean. These type of things. And I have one Benefit Posy Tint, which I only use on my cheeks, which you can use on your lips, so I totally count it. So, that is terrifying for me. <laughs> and I know, like, the Blush Beauty had, like, 75 lipsticks, I think was her count. And please correct me if I'm wrong, because I'm just trying to remember off the top of my head. But that's a lot for me, because I only have, like, a small thing of storage, and, like, one whole drawer is taken up by lip crap. Anyways, next question. What was your first lipstick ever? I don't remember, but the first brand and color of lipstick that sticks out in my mind is a red NYC lipstick that I wore all of my sophomore and junior year of high school, and probably my senior year too, up until I lost it. And they don't make this particular lipstick anymore. It came in like a silver tube and it had like NYC stamped on it in the, what, were the, what are their colors? Like orange, purple, and red or something like that. Like it was, this would have been about 2002. So, so the lipstick from that time. God, I'm old. Anyways, what is my favorite brand? Um, if you go by what I currently have, drugstore, it would be Revlon because... That is what I have the most of, although they were all purchased, I say recently, but in the last six months. And I totally fell in love with their little bomb stains too, although the Jordana one is really good too. I did, Like I said, I did buy one and it's really good too. So I would say Revlon, because I also really like the lip butters. I like their lipstick formula, so we'll go with Revlon. Everybody says Revlon though. What is your most worn lipstick? Um... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Right now, my most worn thing is probably the Tarte Lip Surgeons Crayon in Glitzy. Let's see if I can get y'all a really good look at it. It's basically what I usually wear when I want something neutral. This is neutral for me. 
even though it's still glittery as all get out, it is about what I consider neutral. And if I don't wear that, I wear my Revlon Sassy Mauve lipstick. Probably gonna be covered in swatches before it's over with. Like those are my two neutrals. That's definitely my most used Revlon lipstick. What is your favorite finish? Anything but matte. <laughs> I have really lined lips and honestly sometimes they're kind of chapped. But I can't, I can wear matte and if I like scrub my lips with a lip scrub beforehand it still looks fine but I don't really love the way it feels and I usually wind up putting a gloss over it anyway. So if you give me anything but matte, like cream, satin, whatever, I'm fine. Just matte. Unless I'm like rocking a certain red-lipped look, I don't really like matte. What was the last lipstick you bought? It wasn't a lipstick. Let me make sure this is the right one. No, it's actually not. It, this was actually the last thing I bought. It's the Revlon lips, Lip Stain in Smitten. So I'm, I'm actually thinking about doing a tutorial of a look from a certain music video that I really love. And this is what I needed for it. So I wanted to recreate the look on myself. And I may very well film a tutorial of trying to recreate the look. I still have to find the exact right eyeshadow in my collection. But that is the lip color that it would be. As far as last actual, like, straight up lipstick, I bought these two, these two red ones at the same time about a month ago. One is very rich. Also something I would probably consider in my version of nude. And the other one is red lacquer. It's this kind of orangey red. Those are the two, last two straight lipsticks that I bought. What lip products do you currently have in your bag? Well, whatever I'm wearing at the moment, I will have in my bag. But I also always have these two lip prop these two lip products it's a pucker up lip balm that i bought from my alma mater louisiana tech at some point from the bookstore and this passion party's nibbler strawberry bliss balm it smells like strawberries and it's minty and at least very very hint of like a pink lip and it tingles like crazy so definitely has like the lip plumping effect that some people really like to go for those always stay in my bag, plus, like I said, just whatever I'm wearing at the moment will also go in whatever Ipsy bag I have in my bag at the moment, actually, because those are my lip bags. What's next? So, I guess I have two plus whatever I'm wearing, so it might end up being like four, because I usually wear my baby, my plain baby lips, and then a lip lipstick and a lip gloss so probably like up to five how do you store your lipsticks well I have these little baskets that I got from the Dollar Tree I have two of these and one of these for all my lip products and I store them in one of those little three drawer things that I got from Walmart like those clear containers now you can you can see one of the drawers sticking out in the background because that's what I pulled all my stuff out of to put on the floor and count and everything so, if you ever want to see a makeup storage thing, you can. Mine's not that impressive because I don't have a lot of makeup. What well, in comparison to like beauty, serious beauty gurus on here or anything like that. My husband thinks I have too much makeup, but you gotta have you gotta have variety. Anyways, what do you use to rock a red lip? Well, I use my Rimmel Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner in 024 Red Diva. I'm actually fairly close to being out of it. I'm not going to swatch it because, like I said, I, I have to, I fully cover my lips so that I it doesn't move during the day when I rock a red lip. 
and I have a couple of red lipsticks, so it usually alternates, but what I've been using lately is the Urban Decay Revolution lipstick in 69. And I, even though I'm not the hugest fan of the finish, I really like their colors and I will probably wind up buying some of these $22 lipsticks. $22 lipsticks. But I'm probably still going to buy one. Anyways. And the last question is, what lip products are you currently lusting for? Um, those Revolution lipsticks. There's a couple of them that I want. I have a sample of a couple of different colors somewhere that I got from Sephora. And as far as lip glosses, I'm digging right now, I'm sorry. As far as lip glosses are concerned, I want more of the Buxom lip glosses. This is the only one I have. It's in Dolly. There we go. These give you porn star lips. And this sounds kind of trashy, but I actually kind of like it. Like it makes your lips pouty and stick out and they look kind of wet. And it, looks really sexy honestly so that is it for the lipstick tag I tag whoever the hell sees this <laughs> if you want to do this please feel free just link it to me down below I'm going to make sure to put a list of questions up after I upload this so that you don't have to do like me and have to write them all down and then look off the screen constantly like a gomer anyways that's all I'll see you later, YouTube.